Let me see sort the court. There's sort the cube. Nope. What was that game that wasn't in budget? Uh, Samurai Bringer, but I'm not saying like basically no game is in budget right now because I'm I've I've kind of spent. Sort the court is pretty fun. It's a cute little hourish game. At the place I work, people call PowerPoints peepees. Um, is sort the court on Steam or is it on something else? Sort the court by Graham Borland, itch.io. Yeah, oh, interesting. Is not in active development and has not been updated in several years, so it may not work on newer systems. Free indie game you can play in browser. Let me download it anyway. Hey, Big, my fourth time mentioning this game for you to check out called Lunacid. Basically, Kingsfield, if you know what it, what it is. Uh, I do know Kingsfield. Let me see. I'm sorry, I don't know how I missed that four times. Uh, Lunacid. I'm looking for it on Steam, but... Oh, there it is. Oh, that's even cheaper. Lunacid is a first-person dungeon crawler inspired by... Old from software games like Shadow Tower and Kingsfield. I feel like I have looked at this before. Yeah, this looks this looks very much um, influenced. Thank you, Dimethorn, for adding me to your friends list. Uh, I'm not, uh, I haven't done, like, the whole Discord community thing, like, building a community thing yet. I don't know how I feel about that yet. I've kind of talked about it previously. Um, soundtrack and art in this game is pretty cool. All right, let's do Sort the Court. I don't know anything about it, so that's interesting. Let me put it in my games folder. Um, itch.io is such a good resource for like weird experimental games I usually find something interesting on there sort the court alright it's extracting who recommended paratopic last time just so we can apply due caution uh, I did it was in my Steam list for quite a long time, and it was always something I wanted to try, so I, I uh, tried it. Oh my god. Loud. Hold on a second. Uh, where is my volume mixer? There it is. Where is the game in the volume mixer? There it is. Where is the Steam... The, the game in my sources. There it isn't. It's not there. Oh no. Steam World Heist. Shotgun King. Hip. Oh, I actually, I don't want to spoil what that is. After image. Sort the court. Here we go. Paratopic was fun. A fun is a word that we can apply to many things. <laughs> Basically, the hall from War Sim where you play yes, no to the villagers. Oh, kind of like, um, what is that game called? Rain? Rain is an interesting game. Can't believe it. Big actually tried Paratopic. <laughs> Let me delete my comment. <laughs> All right, here we go. Are you a king or a queen? I am a king. My lord, I'll help you rule your kingdom, but you have to make the tough choices. Just say yes or no. Understand? Yes. Mm -hmm. Good, you've already got the hang of it. Our city's still very small right now, but it certainly has the potential to grow. Perhaps one day we will have a bustling metropolis and you'll be invited to join the Council of Crowns. 
For now, all you need to concern yourself with is keeping the citizens happy and growing our population. Do your best. Ba, 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 ba. Very inspirational music. Working conditions for us are unsafe. Will you please spend some gold on improving our ability to work? Yes. Thanks. The builders appreciate this. Oh, a vampire. I'm the Duke of Spook. Do you want a spooky nickname? Sure. Hmm. Mm. You can be the Creep King. Do, 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 do. The people have started a petition to ban pineapples in the city. Should we do it? Sure. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, the pineapple trade will suffer, but the people demand it. The music is, like, really good. <laughs> There's a party. I'd like to go to this evening, my liege. Might I have the rest of the day off? Sure. Mm -hmm. Thank you. We will toast to your honor. It's a little funny, but it's just yes or no. Wealth, negative 50. People are happy. The city is growing. Population, plus four. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Could care to give it a try? Sure. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was bad. My apologies. I guess the spell turned out to be evil. That was bad. Oh no, a spooky ghost. Oof, you call this a castle? Yes. Mm -hmm. Indeed it is. Trick question. Oh no. Oh, might I borrow some gold for a new juggling ball? No. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Wow, that, that only cost me. Ahem, might I give you a cup of tea for you, my liege? Sure. Aha, uh -huh, yes. Nice and hot, sire. Playing not as crazy Psycho King unsubbed. <laughs> you call this a castle? Yes, again? Indeed, it is. You already came here once. So we did not do so good the second day. People are sad. This The city is shrinking. Oh, no. Just a, hold on, let me get my sad, simple face on. Ah. Wah. Squee. There's a mouse. Should we chase it away? Sure. Mm-hmm. Squee! Phew, it's gone. Wait, maybe we should have heard them out. Bum bum ba dum ba dum dum. Yeah, you like my rhythm, bruh? No. Mm -mm. Ba dum da ba dum tss, bummer. I can't play worse than not as tyrant though. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? No, go away. See, it's understandable that you don't want to take the risk. Farewell. You chased away the tiny mouse? Oh, should I not have done that? The guard confiscated some gold that I, uh, found. Can I have it back? No. Mm -mm. You're keeping it, eh? But I still- I mean, I found it. So? Oh, big old monster. Hey, uh, you, you think you could tell the people to stop calling me Slimeball? It's hurting my feelings. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thanks, boss. All right. No population growth, but we didn't go bad. We didn't go sad. But dum bum bum Boosh. Yeah, you like my rhythm? No. All right. Well, I guess I need to say yes to that guy. Go away, wizard. I noticed you speaking with that wizard again. Is it? Is he bothering you? I can have him banished from the city if you don't wish to be pestered with his magic offerings. What do you say? Yes. Mm -hmm. Very well, I'll inform the guards not to let him back into the city. Morale, can I have some food? Sure. Mm -hmm. I like this music a lot. Oh, it's a mimic. You ever see a treasure chest do a backflip? No. Mm -mm. Well, you're not gonna. Okay. A wave of dark magic, magical energy passed through the city during the night, caused... Causing spooky nightmares for many citizens. Well, I wonder who could be responsible for that. I'm not doing well, apparently. Bard Guild still sucks even in this game. You're not wrong. I think it's just here to pay a visit. Should we leave it? Yeah. Bach, it left some egg. I left behind an egg. Cat. This cat seems slightly magical. Not sure what it wants, though. Uh, is that a question? Wow, well, I guess that's good. Could I trouble you for a sandwich? Surely the cost of one sandwich is nothing to a great king like you. Sure. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. I'm excited to eat this. Oh, might I borrow some gold for a new jiggling ball? Sure. 
Oh, ho, ho, very good. No more wizard roulette. Big just lost out on massive potential gains. I'm little Timmy. Nice to meet you. You like ice cream? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mwah, me too. Okay. People are happy. The city is growing. Nice. We, we've... The, we're still paying the penalty for that wizard's nonsense. You interested in making a deal, bub? Your people's souls in exchange for my gold? How about it? No. Mm -mm. Ah, I'll get you next time, buddy. Uh, it's slime day. Got a present for me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're so nice. I need to finish your War Sim playthrough. It's, uh, it's pretty worth it. I'm, I'm very happy with how that playthrough went. It's honestly a, a, like a set bar for all of my series. I, I want most of my series to be as good as the War Sim playthrough. You feeling spooky today? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Let the blood flow. Well, that was negative one population. Why? My liege, there's a man in the foyer asking to join your guard. He's got an eye patch. Looks a little shifty. What do you think? Should we take a chance on this stranger? Yeah. Indeed. More swords will help us. Good day, sir. Do you require any haunting services? For a small price, I'll scare some people for you. No. Very well, very well. Happiness plus two. People are happy. Good. This is pretty cool so far. It is basically just yes, no, but you gotta make decisions, and decisions are interaction. It's, it's, a, it's a game. Villagers are complaining about garbage in the street. Shall we hire workers to clean it up? Yes. The villagers' noses will thank you, surely. That was a lot of money. You interested in making a deal, bub? Your people's souls in exchange for my gold? How about it? No. I'll get you next time. No, you won't. Uh, I'm hungry. Can I eat some folks? I've got plenty of gold so I can pay you back for their lives. No. Uh, fine. I'll leave them alone. I'm, fr I'm afraid of getting gambling addiction after playing War Sim. My kingdom basically runs on gamble money. Same. Somebody came by and cleaned up my home. You gotta pay me back for that? Yes. Mm -hmm. I guess this guy's garbage was actually a home. I guess this'll do. We're running out of money. Could I trouble you for a sandwich? Surely the cost of one sandwich is nothing to a great king like you. Sure. I'm excited to eat this. We need more population growth. People are happy. The city is growing. Well, not for long if we run out of money. That man you hired earlier has gone missing. Sire, shall we send a search party? Yes. Mm -hmm. We must find him at all costs. Part, my favorite part about this game is that the king is a total manlet. <laughs> Look at his stubby little legs poking off the throne. Yeah. My friends can come over to play? Yeah, alright, sure. Yay, thank ye. Oh my god, I you thought you were banished. Have you seen my magical cat, Pancake? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, very good. I knew he was around here somewhere. I, You're banished, dude. Get out of here. I wish to construct a tavern, but I'll need some gold for me to make it happen. I'm taking a considerable amount of gold here. Like uh, a couple hundred. Sure. Mm -hmm. I'll be in debt. Townsfolk will be happy to have a place to drink. Should we sell off some of our construction supplies to get out of debt? Yes. Mm -hmm. This will set us back a bit, but we need the money right now. It's okay, we got a tavern. We reduced population, but we increased happiness, so we'll make up for that population. Wizard has a few different results, and this game is a lot about gambling. Mal, can I have some food? Sure. I'm hoping we see the village develop a little bit. Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Sure. Mm -hmm. I see. Fame and fortune for you. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening, my liege. Might I have the rest of the day off? Sure. Mm -hmm. Thank you. We will toast to your honor. What are you? Name's Molder. If you want to know the truth about everything, you're going to want to hire me. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go investigate something. Do you have a like a crab friend who's named S Scuttle? Molder and Scuttle? Do you get it? It's not good. My lord, a man wishes to settle a dispute. He says he is way cool, but his friend says he is not. Do you think he is cool? Sure. Mm -hmm. 
I'm sure he'll be happy to hear that. People are happy. We're growing. We're growing. Good day, sir. Do you require any haunting services? For a small price, I'll scare some people for you. No. Very well. I love big... Here's 200-something gold for a tavern. Now sell off your construction equipment immediately for 200-something gold immediately. <laughs> but the logic is, is that I have to assume they still managed to build off the tavern and sold off the supply, the excess supplies. So we won't be able to build anything else, maybe. My lord, I wish to embark upon a treacherous quest. Sure. Mm -hmm. For the kingdom, I shall return to you, my lord. The spirits are appeased right now, but perhaps we should grant them an offering of gold. I know the spirit world always appreciates gold, and it might prevent them from haunting us in the future. What do you say? 200 gold would make a decent offering. Uh, no. Mm -hmm. Nothing for now, then. I'll let you know if anything changes with the spirit world. You don't get it? It's just staring at me. Does it want something? Yes. Mm -hmm. What? Wow. I just lost 100 gold for staring into the eyeball? I couldn't uncover anything. I was being followed. Too risky. Did you see anyone follow me out of the castle? No. I suspected as much. Very suspicious. Okay. We gained nothing and, and our wealth plummeted. Oh, is that a monkey? Peanut. Ook, ook, ook. He's got a shiny coin. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ook. Oh, man. If Big hates the wizard, he's going to be driving, driven crazy by the spirit world haunting. Oh, no. One of our prisoners has escaped. May I have some gold to offer a reward for her recapture? Nah. Forget it. They're probably all the way out of the city by now. Get out of here, ghost. Good day, sir. Do you require any haunting services? For a small price, I'll scare some people for you. No. Very well. No. Get out of here. I This eyeball sucks. I wish to put on a show. May I have funds to do so? How much? 50? Oh my god. The Jester show was loved by the court and put everybody into a happy mood. This was awful. Look, the city is growing, and I can see the village is bigger now. There's a very stinky kid running around the streets. Should we force her to have a bath? Yes. Mm -hmm. Glad you agree. She won't be happy, though. That's fine. Everyone else will be. You call this a castle? Yes. Mm -hmm. Indeed. Ghost, I'm, a, I'm about tired of your crap, if I'm being honest. Feeling spooky? Yeah. Heck yeah. Let the blood flow. Uh, might I get a cup of tea for you? Yeah. Speaking of which, I still have coffee. Oh, heck yeah, coffee. Nice and hot, sire. Not like my coffee. My coffee's cold, actually. Citizens say a monkey has been running around flinging stuff at them. Should we put out a bounty on it? Yes. Mm -hmm. Uh, this is awful. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow. My lord, I've come across a chest of gold in my adventures. Will you please accept this gift? Yes. Mm -hmm. Could really use some money. It is my pleasure to serve you. Thank you. The gold is really low. Gotta fix that ghost unemployment. Name's Mulder. If you want to know the truth about everything, all right. Mm -hmm. Ten gold. Gotta go investigate something. Big shout out to you. Just wanted to say thanks for the good co code content you put put out. Any chance the tutorial seri series will be continued soon? Um, well, the good news is it will be continuing. The bad news is soon? No. Because, and the reason is, is I haven't started it yet. See, um, those, those tutorials take a lot of work. And after I'm done, I've been like editing for tens of like hours, like gotta be like 40 hours each at least and uh so after i finish one i'm like i need a break i don't want to edit for a while so i take a i take a little bit of a break and i haven't started the next one but i will soon a promise do you find do you find me humorous yeah mm -hmm. har har yeah it's a good one right i get it 
The, the knight came through. The knight. We've captured fo some foes on the battlefield. Shall we bring them home and put them to work? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We'll get them into town then. We need to make some money. Oh, a long-haired gardener. Plants are interesting, don't you think? I would like to open a garden. May I have some workers to help me? Sure. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I will send them back as soon as they're done. People are happy. This city is growing. We're doing well. Things are going well. Want me to steal from the rich and give it to you? Not just the rich. I'll steal from whoever, basically. Um, Sure. Mm -hmm. They won't even know what hit them. We gotta, we gotta sacrifice a little bit of happiness for the sake of some money. I'd like to build a new granary. This would, uh, could help c expand our population, but it'll cost a bit. Sure. Mm -hmm. You got it. This will help our city grow. I hope I... I, I want to see that granary in the background. All right, dude. Finally. Sure. I like your rhythm. Okay. I'm in the groove. Good. Why? Can I have a coin? A gold coin? Sure. Thank ya. Petition to bring the circus to town is circulating. Could you attract uh, tourists? Are you interested? Yes. Mm -hmm. Wow, that was only amazing. Let the people have their circus then. Amazing, the circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who to visit. It also happens to bring in a nice bit of gold. The workers we captured and recruited have spend, sped up our building process, resulting in more tax income. Things are going well. Wow, wow. The drummer braps. A nearby town has asked us to form an alliance with them. Should we use them to beef up our ranks? Yes. Mm -hmm. Sounds good to me. More swords for us. Boom, boom, ba -doom. I'm really getting into it. Are you? Yes. That's what I thought. Boo boo do badoosh. So be it. Meanwhile, I'm binge watching your cut playthrough. You already uploaded, trying to get a grasp of the game. I'm uh, I'm glad I can uh, help you play the game better. I you have uh, played cut on stream. We we were doing a pretty interesting run, but it kind of petered out. I think I will do cut again in the future on stream, but uh, we'll probably have to start a new game. I wanna I wanna do a, a short series that wraps up the uh, the triangle the Dorito run, the cursed Dorito run, which was really interesting. He's got a shiny coin. No. Ook ook. He looks sad. This is that circus event I mentioned. Free gold. Oh nice. It seems sad. Mom, wait. If I don't answer, do they go away eventually? Need to ask your permission to go on an adventure. Can I, please? Sure. Yay, I'm so excited to go exploring. You look like you're going to die. Circus is in town, bringing joy to all. Nice, more money. Things are looking up. Look how big our town is. Ooh, something big is being built in the background. Sire, the city's population is growing steadily. Our records of citizenship indicate that 250 people will now, now call the city home. With a bigger city, we'll need to maintain even higher happiness in order to keep people satisfied. Make sure you pay attention to the citizens and their issues to raise our happiness. Anyway, we still have lots of work to do. Let's make the city even bigger. By the way, remember earlier when I mentioned the Council of Crowns? I've heard rumor that one of their members has been searching the land for a new ruler to join them. Perhaps they are aware of our progress. You just sent a child to hunt monsters? Yeah. Why not? Hey, hello, Sonny. Can I borrow a coin for the newspaper? Mm -hmm. Sure. Thank you, dearie. That got, that brought us to a cool, uh, clean 300 coins. Hello, sir. Are you looking for experienced barbers in your court? Yes. Mm -hmm. then, sh then I shall join you. I am the best of the best. You could look like you could use a trim. What the heck is this? Boo. Give me your gold. I'll treat, eat your townspeople. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ouch. 400 gold. Haha, <laughs> yes, I'll take that. <laughs> Seems like you need some gold. I could give you some in exchange for a few souls, maybe. Uh, I probably, I actually wanted to say yes to that. The circus is done. We lost all of our money. All of it. The treasury is empty, my lord. We could raise taxes a bit further, but the people won't like it much. Should we try? No. 
We'll get money other ways. We still need to resolve the issue of having no money. Yeah, I know. We'll we'll get him in other ways. Okay, okay, dude. Negative 20 population. We got 400 coins, though. That was a g fair trade, I think. Citizens from afar and wide come to visit my barbershop. Would you like a fresh cut, sir? Free of charge. Mm -hmm. Sure. Of course you do. You look dashing. Well, I wish they had changed the look of the dude so he had a haircut. Got a shiny coin. No. Mm -mm. Ook You just sent a child to hunt monsters. By the way, thank you for including my name when there are 1984 other people's names that you could have instead of mine in the skin giveaway. <laughs> Well, I mean, at the time, there were only 19 or so commenters. It was a fair and square uh, raffle. I'm a serial number LD 3.4. Can you fix me? Sure. Mm -hmm. 100. Wow. Friend, I am become fixed. This was a bad year, but... Eh. There's a petition going around to open our borders to the neighboring town. What do you say? Sure. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of stuff that we just got. I actually saw my name on that wheel in the video. I laughed my butt off. Well, I mean, everyone commented. It seems happy. What is this eyeball? I don't like this eyeball. Can I have a coin? A gold coin? Sure. Mm -hmm. My show seems to have gone over well. I wish to expand my production. Funds. I shall need 400 gold. God. Okay. Oh, ho, I know it's going to be worth it, but man, I have no money now. I need of cash, huh? I could hook you up if you let me eat a few folk. Okay. Nah, I think that was worth it. Jester dazzled the court with a display of acrobatics and theater, raising the spirits of all in attendance. People are happy. We're getting there. We're getting there. Some villagers are threatening to leave unless we pay them a sum of gold. Should we listen to their demands? Sure. Mm -hmm. I agree. We should do everything we can to keep them here. Want me to steal from the rich and give to you? All right. Sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that. Uh, I don't know. We could do better there, I think. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening. Sure. Mm -hmm. This really is like War Sim. The owners of the tavern are making piles of gold and wish to share some with you. Well, that, I mean, it's, it cost me like 150 to make that tavern. You haven't been talking to Mulder, have you? Uh, no. Hmm, if you say so. I don't know if I trust that alien. I read the nicest story in the paper today. Isn't it a lovely day? Yes. Very good, dearie. Eyeball is from Sort the Court's original release. Before it had the original little Council of Crowns storyline, it was even more random than it is now. I'm hungry. Can I eat some folk? Uh, I've got plenty of gold. Sure. 100 gold for five people? Totally worth it. It's actually not worth it for the gesture to take 300 or 400 gold. He'll keep asking for more. Okay. I'll slay him for a few gold coins if you want. Sure. I'll show you, show those creeps. Okay. Yo, he came back. I'm back. I found those shiny yellow stones. Pretty cool, right? Mm -hmm. Nice. So cool. I told you it was, it was a, a good idea to trust a child to venture off into a dungeon. Petition, petition to bring the circus to town. Yes. More circus. More money. Welcome to the Circus of Values. Gossip is spreading about a heroic purple witch slaying goblins in the lower quarter. She's becoming something of a folk hero. Day 20 complete. Look at all that money and stuff. It, everything is going well right now. Bonjour, my name is Madame Abel, and I've come to join your court. Will you have me? Sure. Mm -hmm. How sweet. I'm sure many wonderful adventures await. I have a funny feeling she's going to bring with her bees. Don't help the jester again. Okay. There's a bunch of goblins in the lower, lower corridor, sure. Mm -hmm. I'll show those creeps. Uh, there's a party I'd like to go this evening. Might I have the rest of the day off? I guess so, but you've been going to a lot of parties there, bud. 
Did Big just make a Bioshock 1 and 2 reference? With <laughs> Yeah, I did. <laughs> right. Some some memories are just deeply ingrained in your brain, aren't they? I need to ask your permission to go on an adventure. Sure. Mm -hmm. Since we opened our borders, trade from our caravans has increased dramatically. Do you wish to tax the merchants? Sure. It'll lower happiness a little bit, but yeah. 100 coins? I expected some a nice chunk of money. Things are going are, are looking up. We just need to make sure we don't get uh, attacked by any dragons. I'm the Duke of Spook. Do you want a spooky nick nickname? Sure. Hmm. You can be the Creep King. Okay. Goodbye. Uh, I have returned from my quest. A great bounty of treasure is ours. Wow. Look at all that money. I'm going to throw money at everything now. Any mysteries afoot? I can do some snooping for a small fee. Yes. I'll uncover the truth and report back to you. Thank you, skelly friend. The town we made an alliance with is in trouble. Should we send soldiers? Yes. Of course, we promised we would protect them. Tax the dragon? I will. Spirits are appeased right now, but we could uh, grant them an offering. Sure, let's, uh, let's do that. I'll conduct the ceremony and offer this to the spirit world. I never played past the beginning of Bioshock 1. That big drill monster scared the heck out of me when I was young. Ah, same, but they become really fun if when you get into the game. They're like just uh, a, nap, a test of like all of your, um, like, I wouldn't say like skill, but like you just want to use all of your resources to kill them. I wouldn't mind doing a Bioshock playthrough for my channel, honestly. It, it, the, the urge occurs to me occasionally. To do a Bioshock playthrough. Oh, we're getting close to being done here. Maybe. You ready for the truth? Aliens have invaded, already landed, and they're they're in our city. You think we're safe? Yes. Mm -hmm. I think so too. Why would they want to harm us? You've been drinking quite a bit of tea, sir. Might I upgrade you to the good stuff? Mm -hmm. Yes. This first cup is on me, sir. I'm sure it won't be your last. Sorry, what is the good stuff? Whiskey? A petition to bring the circus to town. Yes. Mm -hmm. Circus is easy mode. My boat's too tiny to catch many fish. Can I have some gold? Sure. Mm -hmm. 100 gold for a fishing boat? Damn. Butler is sus. I am truly sorry about earlier. My circuits were quite fried. I offer my thanks for your help. Yes. Mm -hmm. Quite logical. Thank you. Circus is in town. Gossip is spreading about a heroic purple witch. Things are looking up. Plus 45. So the, the city is like finished. Since we opened our borders, trade from our caravans has increased dramatically. Do you wish to tax the merchants? Mm -hmm. Sure. 100 gold? Sounds good. We only lost two happiness. That's fine. You would love a Bioshock Let's Play? Yo. Well, you know, my general philosophy is if there's call for something, I will uh, do it so long as it's not, you know, a call for me to do something truly horrible and punishing. 700 gold? Get out of here. I accidentally stayed up all night eating candies. Can I have some gold to go to the doctor? Sure. Mm -hmm. I never thought I could eat too many sweets. Diabetes. What is this strange place I found myself in? Albert, do you know where we are? Oh my, oh my. Hello, you kingly person there. I do believe I am a bit lost. Might I stay in this town for a bit? Sure. Mm -hmm. How nice. Albert and I shall find an inn to stay in. I'm sure I will see you again. Albert seems to like you. I just replayed the game last year for that. I chose the impossible achievement, hardest difficulty, and no Vita Chambers. Damn. Some villagers are threatening to leave unless we pay them. Sure. Mm -hmm. Circus is in town. Negative one happiness, really. But we gained quite a lot of population. Our search party has turned up the missing man, sire, and nine of his friends. There's something else being built in the background. Is it a rocket ship? 
City's population has reached 500. The townspeople are celebrating. There's to be a huge festival in the square. Our growing population will demand even more happiness now. Be sure to keep our approval high. Anyway, I just wanted to give my congratulations. Let's keep working hard, okay? Yes. Wonder how big this city will grow under your rule, sir. Name's Mulder if you want to know the truth about everything. Sure. I'm going to go investigate something. Ma, can my friends come over to Poi? Sure. When you have all the money in the world, you can say yes to anything, except the jester. I would like some money, please. Okay. Thank you for the money, good sir. This is good money. I, I feel like I should have told them no. Festival in the town square celebrating the town's 500 citizen will still is still going strong, bringing happiness to all those who attend. Circus is packed up and left the town. I don't know what those things in the background are doing. No, Jester, get out. Petition to bring the circus. Yeah, I mean, they just left, but sure, let's bring them back. Did you know the, the man named George Washington Hitler named his son... <laughs> What? Who became a well-respected dentist? It's running wild. Should we try to capture it? Sure. Mm -hmm. Whoa, this thing is dangerous. It killed someone? Bunch of goblins. Sure. Mm -hmm. I'll show those creeps. I'm back. Found some friends for the adventure. Do you like my new friends? Yeah, new friends are the best. Reporting in, I found a way to summon people from another dimension. Want me to summon some folks? Sure. Ooh, magic of questionable origins. <laughs> That's pretty good. Circus is in town. Gossip is spreading about a witch. I'm sure she'll be my downfall. But you're a ball of yarn. Yarno, I am Yarno of the Comfy Kingdom. You may not believe this, but I am the royal assistant of Kingpin himself. Indeed, the very same. I've been noodling around this kingdom of yours and- Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, wait. What's that over there? Excuse me? Good goodbye It's a button! Yo, adorable. Did you happen to see a blue fellow come through here just now? Strange newly limbs made of yarn? Yes. I knew he was around here somewhere. I'm gonna find that darned Yarno. He's been running around claiming to be Kingpin's royal assistant, which of course he is not. In fact, it is I, Button Boy, who represents the Comfy Kingdom and the esteemed Council of Crowns. Have you heard of the Council of Crowns, good sir? Yes. Then surely you've thought about joining. Perhaps we could work out a bit of a deal. That Yarno's been giving me nothing but trouble. If you could somehow put a stop to his shenanigans, I might be able to put, uh, get you a meeting with the Pia, the advisor of the Celestial Kingdom. Pia? If anyone uh, would be, if anyone would be able to induct your kingdom into the council, it would be her. What do you say? Will you help me catch that darned yarn? Sure. Very good. I'll leave the details up to your discretion. Uh, once Yarno is out of the way, I'll set up a meeting with Paya. Thank you for your assistance in this matter, good sir. I'm sure we will meet again soon. I've completed work in the garden. Are you pleased? Yes. I am so glad. Oh, mouse. There's a mouse. Should we chase it away? No. Squee, it seems happy. We we got the mouse. Are you happy, chat? Are you proud of me? I was uh, considering opening up a soup shop. Think it's a good idea? Need some gold. Sure. Very well, I'll sell my soup in the town. Would you like to buy some flowers from our garden? They're a special low price for you, sir. Flowers are so lovely. Uh, what's your opinion on Bioshock Infinite? I love 1 and 2, but I feel like Infinite missed a lot of what made the original Bioshock great. Um... So, I'm gonna get, uh, maybe spicy for a bit. Here, I'll get my spicy face on. This is my spicy face. <laughs> uh, I didn't play it because, um, I generally don't buy AAA games as they come out. Um, the only exception to that rule is, of course, basically anything from, from software. Uh, and... I, you know, looked at what people were saying about Bioshock Infinite and didn't buy it because it didn't seem like something that I was going to enjoy. So I haven't played it. Um, if I played 1 and 2 for the channel and there was call for me to play Infinite, then I might do that. But as far as I'm concerned, I don't 
need to play it? Oh my god. Stop it. Spicy take. It's, the spicy take is I haven't played it, and it's not even a take. It's like truly not exciting. De Devil, don't deal with him. He's bad. No, you pay monsters usually, or else they kill your citizens or happiness. Love the spicy face, and yeah, you don't really miss out on anything with Biofy. Shotgun. It's massively overhyped. Is it overhyped? Because I've I've honestly only ever heard like very middling to negative um, takes on that game. Builders wish to construct more houses in the city. Request more gold. Look how cool the village looks. Can I have some food? Sure. There you go, boots. Uh, hey, uh, good friend. I thought you might be interested in making a deal. A good, wholesome, friendly deal. Uh, an angel, such as myself, could offer you lots of happiness. It would cost you some gold, though. How about this? A few hundred gold from you, and I'll make sure your citizens are happy. Should I take this deal, chat? I don't buy AAA games, but doesn't mean that I don't play them sometimes. Oh, is that... Is that... You... Talking about playing games that you don't own that you may have downloaded from some kind of place online is that what you're saying are you saying that you wouldn't you wouldn't want to illegally download software from the internet now would you i didn't think so he seems trustworthy i'm going to press the y button in 3 Seconds. Three. Two. One. All right. Doesn't matter if it's good or bad. Honestly, I just love making deals. <laughs> Maybe he lives in Russia where illegal piracy is legal. Is it legal in Russia? One thing by Bioshock Infinite was it is a beautiful game. Still overhyped. There's a lot of beautiful games that are not very interesting, in my opinion. There's your spicy take. Beautiful games... Okay, I know I say a lot of the time, wow, I really like the look of this game. Uh, I generally do gravitate towards games that are pretty to look at, but um, graphics are only the entryway for me. Like, if it doesn't have depth to it in some form, then I'm not interested. Since we op opened our borders, trade from our caravans has increased. Yes, let's get some money back. Mm -hmm. Spicy take. Deck builders are better than... What? What? D do you want my spicy deck builders take? Like Minecraft. Big that Minecraft ship post was really dirty looking. <laughs> Guess maybe in recent times people are taking another look and realizing when Bioshock Shock Infinite first came out, people were lining up to make its. <laughs> you can't just say that. You can't just say that and expect approval. Hello, King. I am a, a tree of the Western Force, as you can see. However, I have been, shall we say, shortened. This is due largely, in fact, to the actions of your team of woodcutters. My home has been chopped clean, though. In your reckless uh, pursuit of expansion, you have now disrupted the lives of myself and my good tree folk, brothers and sisters. I demand compensation by way of golden coin, so that we might repair this. How shall I put it? Diplomatic rift between us? A paltry sum of, oh, say, 1,000 coins would go a long ways towards relaxing our troubled relationship. Okay. First step on the path to recovery has been taken. While this does not go unnoticed, be sure that I am not finished. I will be speaking with your mason immediately regarding matters of sustainable woodland harvesting. You've done the right thing here today. My good tree folk will respect that despite your woodcutter's aggression. With this, I bid you a good day. May your roots grow deep and strong. Not just talking. It, just graphics. All this stuff said in Flying City is very interesting sight now. Yeah, I mean, sure. Could hook you up. Let me eat a few folks. Okay, go ahead. I could definitely uh, use a bit of cash right now. My lord, I've come across a chest of gold. Amazing. Your timing could not be better. 
My, the treasury is empty, my lord. We could raise taxes a bit. Sure. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now we're back in the black. Our soldiers are coming home, and our assistance in defending our allies has not gone unnoticed. We've been offered a bounty of gold by the captain of their military, a good fellow. Infinite tried to steal, tried to beat it in hard mode with gun only upgrades and not use any vigors. Unfortunately, you have to buy ammo in that game, which does not work with tight save checkpoints. I told you not to deal with the devil. Is that what happened? Is dealing with the devil what created the wood problem? Is this cat trying to tell me something? It seems like it wants to help. Yarno? Is he talking about Yarno? Maybe this cat could help find Yarno. I'll need to provide plenty of tuna, of course, but surely it would be worth the cost. Yeah, hire this cat. Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my va magical vampire crystal? Sure. I see. Fame and fortune for you. I've been very lucky with the vampire, I think. Since we opened our borders trade from our caravan... Yeah, we need money. Uh, no. All your gold is gone. The boundary of your expanding city is beginning to conflict with the border of my nation. More specifically, your workers have begun constructing a fence in my backyard. This is made even more affronting by the fact that my backyard is underwater. I demand that you cease construction of this fence and maintain your border at its current position. Um, what's the call here, honestly? I feel like no, but I do think that that is asking for trouble. Sure, for now. I've got some cleaning up to do around my property. Fishermen report seeing schools of dancing mermaids in the water raising their spirits. Things are going well. Oh my god. Just say yes and keep upgrading. If I like the game, I buy it and support it with all my heart, but sometimes you just don't have much money to spend on a game that you might not even like. True. Doesn't it warm your heart? Yes. It's lovely to have so many new friends. He's just a fish. I mean, sharks are just a fish. Would you like to buy some flowers? Yeah. Flowers are so lovely. Do you require any haunting services for a small price? I'll scare some people for you. Sure. Why do you want to scare people away? Oh, well, I'll do it. Listen, I just want to see what it ha what happens once. Couldn't un uncover anything. I was being followed. Too risky. Did you see anyone follow me out of the castle? No. I ate sharks for dinner. True. Mysteries afoot? I can do some snooping for a small fee. Sure. I'll uncover the truth and report back to you. This was not a good year. 50 people, wow. Since we opened our borders trade from the caravan, yeah. Wah, 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 wah. Squee, it's the same mouse from before. Is he offering me something? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, he found a coin. Mew, it's that slightly magical cat from before. Does this mean we're friends now? Yes. I guess we are. Hello, I am from the neighboring Ocean Kingdom. What a lovely castle you have, although it is quite dry. Have you ever been to the Ocean Kingdom? No. Oh, I see. Not much of a swimmer, are you? I can't fault you for that, I suppose. Mouse Redemption. Yeah, but like... Hmm. All right, give me the money. Rit. That's the rat sound. Can I have some food? Sure. We've got to be getting close to the end of this, right? Sure. I don't know why I keep hiring Mulder. He doesn't really do anything for me at all. Extra food we've been able to store in our granaries has attracted more settlers. Shall we let them in? Yes. Very good. Yes. Here we go. Brum, 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 brum. Yes. Yeah, I knew you'd like it. I loved it. Another cup of tea, my liege? I've got more of that good stuff you like. Yes. Here we go. Go do drink up, sir. It's poison. I know it is. Can't trust the butler. 
We're getting close to a thousand people. That was a rat sound? Maybe if the rat crawled out of Caves of Cud. Maybe. We're summoning in more people from another dimension. That's the rat sound. Big news, our population has reached 1,000. Be sure to mind our happiness rating. The citizens expect the best from us. Citizens from far and wide come to visit our barbershop. Would you like a fresh cut, sir? Yes. Some very strange creatures wish to move into the house we built. Shall we allow it? Sure. All are welcome in our town. We're getting kind of we're getting close to building the big big thing. Mm -hmm. This game is exactly like Red Dead Redemption, but better. <laughs> mm -hmm. How many times are you gonna cut my ha hair? I, I I must not have much hair left. Our city has grown so much that visitors are becoming lost quite easily. Shall we devote more gold to hiring? Tour guards? Tour guides? Yes. Sounds good. City grows. We require more gold to continue expanding. An increase of our construction... Oh, sure. Ours will be a city rivaled by none at this rate. We need money now. Treasury is empty, my lord. Raise taxes? Sure. One of the games that was... This is certainly one of the games that was ever made. <laughs> What does that mean? This is one of the games that was made. Uh, the spirit world always appreciates gold. Sure. Mm -hmm. It's going to put us back in the red, unfortunately. You know what? Sure, Chester, you can eat some people. It's kind of worth it. 10 people for 250 gold. Feeling spooky? Nah. Not even a tiny spooky? A little baby bat? Some nasty bugs have made a home out of our garden. Can we have some gold to hire an exterminator? Sure. Our plants are safe. I like this game. I like the game. It is certainly better than one of the games. <laughs> I like this game. It is better than other games. We're getting up there. We're getting up there. You ready for the truth? Aliens have already landed and they're in their city. Do you think we're safe? Yes. I think so too. I guess we get a little bit of population growth for that. I've been working on a video game. It's this new thing I came up with. Think it will catch on? Yes. Me too. I'm excited about the possibilities. Anyway, it's a game you play with others and go around killing monsters. You get a sword. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, swords are great, right? So when you slay a monster, you get experience points and hey, are you still listening? Yes. Mm -hmm. Good. Well, thanks for listening to my idea. No. Oh, I actually wanted to say yes. He already ate the people. Damn it. Oopsie. Would like to buy some flowers? Sure. The barber keeps coming in to give a big, big a trim, but the hair of Big's head never changes. That means the barber is trimming. Ooh. What is he trimming? What is he trimming, though? Uh, I would re like to request an assistance of my own. May I have but one person? Sure. Thank you, my sweet. Laws vary around the world. Some places are far more restrictive than others. Can't be helped. And scalpers try to sell physical copies for a terrible markup. What are we talking about? Are we talking about games? Some families have moved into the new houses we built. Should we send them a welcome basket? Yes. Let's just say the PP place has never looked so groomed. Citizens from far and wide come to visit my barber shop. Mm -hmm. oh, how many times are you going to trim me, my dude? Some of the villagers mentioned they saw an alien walk around. You know anything about this? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I knew it. I need to go find Mulder. When are we going to catch Yarno? Our granary stock has been infected. It'll cost us to replace it. But if we don't, people could get sick. Should we do it? Yes. People's health it is worth the cost. We're getting close. I'm hungry, can I eat some folks? I've got plenty of gold. Sure, you know what? We could use some extra money. 
it's usually worth doing. Another chapter in the rebuilding of our people's bond has been penned this day. I have spoken with your mason on the topic of sustainable construction techniques, though he was not at first wholly receptive to my ideologies. In due time, I did convince him to see things my way. I thank you for your cooperation, such as it has been in this manner. That's it, huh? Uh, very talkative tree stump just came by to give me an earful. I was saying something about not cutting down so many trees, I think. What's the deal? Do I have to listen to that thing? Yes. Really? We're taking orders from trees now? Well, you're the boss. This will slow down our construction some, but I can't just say no to you, sir. Uh, stop cutting my hair. Stop it. Some nasty bugs have made- yeah, and exterminator. I'm just waiting for the freaking bug citizens to make their way in here. It's like, you've been hiring exterminators and now all my people are dead. We're going to need some money to help make amends for this. And then and then the gardener's going to go back, oh, the bugs, they're back and they're terrorizing my garden. And we're going to need some, you, you're you going to have to hire a demon in order to slay these bugs. And then the demon people are going to be like, what are you looking at us for? Yes, mm -hmm. circus. A group of mermaid traders made a visit to our market today, resulting in slightly increased trade profits. This was a good day. We're very close. I think we're done. We finished the city. It's my bounty hunter cat. I had almost given up on him. Did you get him? Did you get, find Yarno? Yes, we got him. You got me. That cat just wouldn't leave me alone until I came back here. Was it Button Boy who sent the cat? He's been trying to steal my position as advisor for years. He claims to be the true advisor, but it's just a lie. He's only a button after all. I, Yarn of the Blue, am the true advisor to the Comfy king Kingdom. Except no substitute. Whoops, gotta run. Uh, guard sees at Yarn. Well done, sir. I'm not sure how much a part you actually played in this, but Yarn has been found. I'm in a generous mood, so I'll set up a meeting with Advisor Paya of the Celestial Kingdom. She's quite busy, but you should expect her to come by sometime soon. Make sure this castle is nicely clean. You'll want to impress her. Care to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Of course. It's paid off every time for me so far. An angry pineapple trader has denounced your rule. Shall we have her arrested? Yes. Mm -hmm. Very good. Nobody must stand against your decree. You've got a skeleton of your own, you know. Don't you find it weird that you can't see it? Yes. Yeah, it's pretty weird. Don't you think about it too- Don't think about it too much. I'm hungry. Can I eat some folks? I've got plenty of gold. I can pay you back. Sure. We could- We, we need more money right now. Circus is in town. I need to ask your permission to go on an adventure. Sure. Do a vampire voice. Ooh, I'm a spooky vampire. That's it. That's all you get. Uh, yep. I wish to embark on a treasure. <laughs> yeah. A lot of the same right now. Uh, ooh. I've got a business proposition for you in your tiny town. Are you interested? What do you mean tiny town? I got thirteen hundred people. Bring your detail. Bring you details soon. It's a bunch of goblins in the lower quarter. Yep. Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my magic? Well, he's just a. Uh, I don't know what he is, honestly. Sure. Fame and fortune for you. Blah. Party going around at the tavern tonight. The citizens rejoice, singing and dancing together into the night. That was very spooky. I am spooked. We gotta be getting close to the end here. Expecting an esteemed visitor from the Celestial Kingdom. Shall I go about summoning the servants to prepare the count? Yes. Of course, of course, it is imperative that shall she, she that she be impressed. Did you just imitate Count Count? Uh, it was actually Count Blah from uh, Greg the Bunny. That's a callback that basically no one will appreciate. 
The soup shop's been doing well. I came to offer you some of our earnings. Is it soup? I'm not interested if it's not soup. Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my magical cri vampire crystal? Blah. I see death and misery. What? Excuse me? Well, it's still worth it. The prison is in need of repairs. Might there be room in the budget? Sure. 250? Jesus. Mrow, can I have some food? Of course, Boots. You're like the sole reason our, we're going to be part of the ending here. That was a bad day. Really bad day. Damn. I'm back. Mm -hmm. Making new friends? Yes. Oh, a scientist? Hello, I am... Well, I am the scientist. I do science for you, King. You see, the city has grown, and we have grown too. Science community, that is. We now have our very own council of science, of which I am the leader. Today, I simply wish to introduce myself. And now I have... I have... I will visit you again in the future regarding our project, science projects. Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my vic- Oh my god, stop being- Listen, I- You you paid out so many times. Uh, sure, Mulder. Slicely- Yeah, does this mean we're friends now? We're friends. Magical cat. That's good. This was a bad day. When does Celestia get here? You and me, we really get along, don't we? I wanted to tell you a secret. I actually eat humans because of a curse a witch put on me. I'd stop if I could, but you know, curses. Think it could help me break the curse? I don't want to keep eating people forever. Sure. Thanks, buddy. I knew you'd help me. Keep an eye out for any magical folks who might be able to break the curse. That would be the witch, right? I've returned from my quest. A great bounty of treasure is ours. Amazing. Some plant people have sprouted in the gardens. Are we allowing them to be official citizens? Of course. Wow. Plant people, huh? There's a party I'd like to go to. Yo, when is the Pia of Celestial Kingdom getting here, huh? Oh, I'm a blacksmith and I like to set up shop here. I can pay my own way. I just need your permission. Haha, <laughs> yes. I'll show you my incredible skill. Just you wait. My, the latest GOG Galaxy update broke... GOG Galaxy again. I've never felt the need to install that. Is it good? Oh, there you are. I am Paya, advisor to King Andromedus of the Celestial Kingdom. What a beautiful castle you have here. Everything is spotless. I was just wondering, wandering through your city and was quite impressed with your citizens. You know, the Council of Crowns is searching for a fifth member. Is that something you might be interested in? Yes. I thought as much. I'll inform King Andromedus. I'm sure he would be happy to meet you and discuss the details. Oh my, was that the kingdom from the Celestial Kingdom? This is so exciting. The Celestial King sits at the head of this Council of Crowns. Any connection with them will surely do us well in the future. I heard about the dragon attack you were made to endure. I've come up with an idea to strike back. I can craft a blade powerful enough to slay the dragon and take all his treasures. It didn't even look like a sword. It was just a giant band of pure steel. How does that go? It was just a ginormous steel block of sword. It won't be easy, though. I'll need to track down the finest metals. They're quite costly. A few hundred gold, sure. Mm -hmm. Worth it. If I ever get attacked by that dragon again, they'll be sorry. I will keep you posted about further developments. I won't let you down. We'll strike back at that dragon yet. King looks so despondent. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Uh, you know what? No. Taking the high road. It costs us like five happiness and it gets us only 50 gold. Mm -hmm. ba, ba, ba. My sales have brought in record profits. I'd like to give you something as thanks. Will you accept my gift? Yes. Only 40? When GOG Galaxies actually works. The king looks so despondent. His garden literally created sentient light. I mean, yeah. The, he's had skeletons summon in people from another dimension as well. You had one job. Vampire is low cost gamble. Wizard is a moderate gamble. You were doing really well. I don't believe I've per I believe I've perfected my show. Gold it does require, but happiness it will bring. Seven hundred gold. Get out of here. Never darken my door again. Banished. 
I heard you were looking for someone magical to help a situation regarding a treasure chest. I could give you whatever mystic assistance you need for a small price, of course. Yes. Fantastic. A curse, is it? I'm no stranger to those. I'll have your friends sorted out in no time. This blacksmith is super important, I gathered. Some villagers are threatening to leave unless we pay them a sum of gold. Should we listen to their demands? Of course. I agree. Oh, it's an alien. Why'd you go and rat me out? That pesky molder won't leave me alone now. I'm just trying to lead a normal life here. I don't need all this commotion. Raise my prices? Sure. King looks like he's dead on the inside. He looks like he's dead on the outside, too. Some refugees have arrived in town. Should we welcome those? Yeah. Very good. This game is longer than I expected. That's not a complaint. It's just an observation. Can you hear them rejoicing? Yay. Oh, yeah. Yo, Boots, my favorite. Mm -hmm. Love you, Boots. Boots is my favorite. No, get out of here, thief. Uh, you call this a castle? Yes. Mm -hmm. Do we have a god emperor situation here? We might. Any mysteries afoot? I can do some snooping. Sure. Mm -hmm. I got a friend from which school looking to move to town. Could I get a couple gold to help her move in? Sure. Wow, wow, wow. My sales have brought in record profits. So I'd like to give some to you. Thank you. Our road network is expanding and in need of maintenance. Sure. Uh, Duke of Spook, do you want a spooky nickname? Sure. You can be the Creep King. Why? That's the third time you've named me the Creep King. People are happy. Could I trouble you for a sandwich? Sure. An offer for you, friend. I would purchase a shipment of luxury goods from you for a fair price. Okay. Quite agreeable. We shall work together again, I hope. That costs me quite a bit of happiness. But money is money, I suppose. You like my new haircut. Thank you. You don't look any different. Since we open our borders, trade from our caravans. Sure, mm -hmm. tax them. We've got a lot of money. <clears throat> We're back in the back in good good ways. Might I have some gold to make an offering at the ocean shrine? A hundred gold. Oh my god. Okay, fine. Oh, make way, make way for King Andromedus, Lord of the Celestial Kingdom. Ooh, look at look at him. You don't always need to make such a fuss about my entrances, Paya. Anyways, yes, hello, good king. I've heard much about you and your people. We in the council are quite impressed with you and would love to induct you. There's just one small issue. All four of the existing council members must be present to induct a new member, but I'm afraid Queen Chanterelle and Queen Carith, Sarith ha are having a bit of a fight at the moment. We'll need to calm them down and settle their dispute before you can join the council. You should be hearing from their advisors shortly. I'm entrusting you with the task of reconciling uh, reconciling the two queens. Best of look, luck to you, and afterwards that seat on the council shall be yours. I'll keep an eye out for the advisors from the Ocean Kingdom and Plant Kingdom, sir. Oh. Ocean Kingdom and Plant Kingdom, huh? Hello, Sonny. Can I borrow a coin from the newspaper? Sure. Hello, hello. The Council of Science has devised a blueprint for a gold-generating machine. It will take some time to construct, yes, and many resources, but if my calculations are correct, at least it will produce gold steadily for the rest of eternity. Perhaps you might initiate this project. 500, huh? Mm-hmm. Can I have a coin? Yeah. I only get 50 population every day. You'd think I would get more. 
You ready for the truth? Aliens have, in, have landed. They're in our city. You think we're safe? Yes. Mm -hmm. I think so too. So why do you keep searching for them if you if you know they're here and you know we're fine? Uh, asked by a warrior tribe to the south to supply a great number of weapons. Do I have your permission to supply them? I'll need some extra gold. Sure. Now we are broke again. <laughs> Sell off some construction supplies? Sure. Some nasty bugs have made a home out of our garden. Sure. Villagers are threatening to leave. Oh my god. Take our money. Take the money. Infinite gold sink. Here we come. Loud noises are heard throughout the nights coming from the Council of Sciences chambers. Children have a hard time sleeping. Might I have some gold to make an offering? Sure. I've discovered an underground crime ring in the city's eastern ward. I've already taken steps to break up their operation. Could I have a bit of extra gold to bring in the guards and make some additional arrests? Sure. Uh, seems like you need gold. Never from you, bud. Uh, why, why are you here again? Yay! You came at the perfect time. We're almost done our new growth. Seems your court is with, without much cake. I can provide cake. I'm a cake chef. May I join you? Thank you. I'm grateful. I am cakeful. I will make you cakes. See you later. Is he offering something? Mm -hmm. We're just saying yes to everyone at this point. Some villagers are threatening to leave. 50 gold. Would you like to purchase any swords for your guards? A well-protected city is happy. Sure. Oh, that wasn't very much and it was good. Scientists have constructed a large factory to further their work on the gold generating machine. Pollution becomes a problem for nearby homes. Wow, 2,000 wasn't enough? Oh, it's Advisor Pontus. I am Advisor Pontus of the Ocean Kingdom. Recently, a dispute has been raised between our queen and the plant kingdom. A plot of marshland has been discovered and must be legally marked as one kingdom's property. Since the marsh contains water, clearly it must belong to the Ocean Queen. The plant people, plant queen refuses to listen to reason, however, and insists it should be hers. Will you support your our claim to the marshland? Will you help the Ocean Kingdom? Oh god, that's a hard one. I don't know. I don't have much dealings with the plant people. I have been like paying tribute to the ocean people's like ocean gods, whatever, for like several days now. I've never seen a game of uh, Sort the Court take this long. Oh God, am I bad at video games? Take it for yourself. I don't, I, I don't think that's an option. But no, surely you do not believe the marsh should go to the plant people instead. I don't think it should go to either. It's a party I'd like to go to this evening. Mm -hmm. he, the devil will cut your co population in half? Jesus. If this is true, it could change everything. I'll be launching my own independent investigation. I just wanted to come here and thank you. My run of Sort the Court took two hours and I didn't finish all the side interactions. Yeah, just the main. Mm -hmm. Now we're, we're in the red again. Need a cash, huh? I could hook you up. Sure. Mm -hmm. All right, dinner time. Oh, how come that guy is not uncursed yet?
Would you like to purchase my swords? Yeah. Might I have some gold? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Honestly, I feel like I'm going to start saying no to the ocean person. Mm -hmm. Thought you might be. We can make quite a bit of money this way. Wow, why are people threatening to leave all the time? Is it because they're not happy enough? Mm -hmm. Oh, noises. I, I, I regret saying yes to the uh, scientist people. Mm -hmm. Um, no. Go away. You've, you've asked me for money so many times and paid off never. Oh, yay, circus. Circus time. Mushroom people. My name is Advi Advisor Agaric. I represent the plant queen. What? Hold on. Mushrooms aren't plants. There's something else. Chanterelle. We heard your denouncement of the ocean kingdom in this matter of the marshland. As a land filled with grasses and plant life, that marsh rightfully belongs to the plant queen. Therefore, we are, of course, thrilled to have your support. I, all right, I offer our thanks on behalf of the plant kingdom. Except I don't think it's yours either. Would you like to buy some flowers? Mm -hmm. Sure. It means you've lasted longer than most people. Oh. Some refugees have arrived in town. Should we welcome them? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, to be fair, these this, these decisions are not super difficult. Only 450 people are happy. Is that how that works? Mm -hmm. It's harder to raise happiness than it is to raise population. Youngsters at the Council of Science are making a racket. Could you tell them to keep it down? Mm -hmm. Sure. I can always not do that and just say yes. No, get out of here. No. My friend from which school wanted to thank you for your help, so he made you some magical cookies. Yay. Wait, what, what kind of cookies did you say? Can I have some gold to go to the doctor? Sure. Happiness becomes population at the end of each day. It does not represent directly the amount of happy people in your kingdom. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. I'm going to say no, Mulder. Mulder, you haven't really paid out. The circus has left. Loud noises are still happening. That, I hope that pays out eventually. Hello, good king. It seems the trouble regarding that marshland has all been cleared up. Once Queen Chanterelle realized she won, she was willing to split the marsh with the ocean people. Sometimes the leader just needs a bit of respect, you know? Well, either way, your input helped to break the stalemate. For that, I am thankful. As promised, your seat on the council. I'll have Paya make the final arrangements and inform you when you're ready to induct... When we're ready to induct you. Thank you again for your assistance. Wow, that was easy. Mushrooms are actually closer genetically to animals than plants. Yeah, I mean, they're, they're, they're weird. They're not plants at all. Hello again, kingly person. Oh, Albert asked me to come here and tell you tell you a story. Yellow bird meets a green bird in the sky. Does a yellow bird soar higher than the green? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yellow bird wheels through the sky. She shimmers in the sunlight. Oh, how lovely. Up high in the sky, the yellow bird meets a blue bird. Does a yellow bird stop to sing with it? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, the sweet musical notes of the two new friends fill the air. I feel like this is has to do with population growth. Happiness and, and money. 
flock of nearby birds all of all shapes and colors. The sky is filled with song. What a lovely ending to the story, don't you think? Albert liked it. I'll have come, we'll come to visit you again sometime, kingly person. It's fun to tell you stories. Soup shop's been doing well. Do you have some soup? I don't care about the money. Just give me some soup. Do you like to purchase any swords? Sure. Mm -hmm. You got a shiny coin. I always figured this weird lady was that alien that Mulder and Scully kept talking about. Well, we saw the alien. He's just trying to live a normal life, whatever an alien normal life looks like. I am the Duke of Spook. Do you want a spooky nickname? No. Mm -mm. Oh man, you're no fun, blah. Also, what is it with the word mushroom? Who looks at fungi and thinks mushroom? Who looks at mushroom and thinks fungi? Spirits are appeased right now, but perhaps we should grant them an offering. Sure. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of money, but sure. <laughs> I forgot they put an actual alien in the game. Could I borrow you for a sandwich? Mm -hmm. Sure. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening. Sure. Plant people are hosting a party at the garden tonight, sharing their fresh fruits and vegetables with the villagers. Aren't those plants? We're eating their people. People are demanding that a notorious criminal be exiled from the city. His crimes include theft, arson, and forgery. What do you say? Shall we ex exile him? Sure. I'll have the guards do so at once. Animals plant... Fungi and Protista. Sorry about the dragon blade. Yes, that's what I'm calling the sword now. I've purchased some top quality materials, but I'll need workers to help me do the crafting. Can you spare a few men? Sure. Thank you for the five gold, mouse. No. Get out of here. Go back. To the ocean fish yo thank you for the money louis louis was giving out free cake in the market today much to the citizens delight we're almost done with like our ultimate kingdom here since we open our borders trade from our caravans yeah go ahead and tax them worth it hope you have enough gold i believe there's one more challenge before you join the council Uh oh my boat's all fixed up thanks to you all it's about time i started paying you back for your loan well you only paid me back a hundred and i paid a hundred for your boat mm -hmm. hello friend care to gaze into my crystal magic magical vampire crystal ball sure blah i see fame and fortune for you Ah, 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 ah. Mm. Yo, there's a bunch of goblins. When are you going to cure my min mimic friend, huh? That's been pending for a long time. Do you like a fresh cut? Sure. I assume at 2,500. Can I do some snooping? Sure. Mm -hmm. This game very much reminds me of a, like a sock pop game. Good day, sir. We're ready to officially induct you into the Council of Crowns. There are a few formalities to observe. Can I skip over those and give you the short version? Sure. Mm -hmm. Really doesn't matter. And this way I won't end up losing my voice. All right, gather around, everybody. I'm an advisor, celestial kingdom, kings, blah, blah, blah. You're a king, too. You're a good king. We're inviting you. You're accepting. It's all very well and good. On behalf of the Council of Crowns, I now pronounce you a crowned king. All right, well, we're done. You're in. Now that you're part of the council, representatives from other kingdoms may come to you for help. Make sure to do your best to assist them. 
Sincerely, congratulations. The council is the highest rank to which a king can rise. We're not done. And pig banish the red wizard. Oh, oh no. Soup's been doing well. Is that is that the end, or are we still going? My broom's all worn out. It's my birthday. Think you can buy me a new broom? Sure. We still haven't killed the dragon. GG endless mode unlocked. Is that for real? You can keep playing the game big, but that was the official ending. You've completed the game. You can continue to play as long as you want to wrap up any loose ends. I mean, I wouldn't mind killing the dragon, but like... Lock now involving the other kingdoms, but the story is over. That is basically endless mode. Game over. The game is over. All right. Um, so there's an hour and a half left of stream. I'm going to go uh, take a short minute break. Just a minute. 